So this is 2022 KCSE Mathematics Paper 1, number 16. The base A, B, C, D, E, F of a right pyramid is a regular hexagon of side 2.5 cm. Point V is the vertex of the pyramid uh, and the length of the slanting edges is 4 cm. Uh, draw a well-labeled net of the pyramid and there you get three marks. Uh, so for us to be able to do this, we can make a sketch of our, of our, of our figure. Uh, so a hexagon is a six-sided figure uh, that is uh, six-sided. So those are three. So we have that, we have that. Uh, it is just a sketch and we have that. Uh, so this is uh, that and we have that. Then we can have the slanting sides, uh, slanting sides like that. So that is a sketch. So this side is 2.5 centimeter and the slanting side is 4 centimeter. So we need to draw the net of this. <laughs> If you look at the base, uh, that is uh, for a six-sided uh, figure. Uh, so this is that. So this angle here, it has six uh, triangles. So this angle is 60, so 60 is 60. Base angles are equal, 60. So we need to make an angle of a line and we make an angle of uh, 120. And since we are not restricted the instrument that we will need to use, uh, we can use uh, a ruler. So you bring, uh, you take a ruler and you draw a line. You draw a line. Uh, this line we can measure. Uh, you can still use a ruler to measure or you use a compass or you use a divider. Uh, any, any you can do. Uh, so this is where we have 2.5 uh, so we have marked the, the 2.5 mark uh, so from there so this is what we have our line 2.5 one of the sides we draw an angle of uh, 120 so that uh, we get uh, the next line so we can bring our 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 we can bring our our protractor here and uh, to draw an angle of 9, 120 uh, I'll draw it like that uh, 120 uh, that not that uh, 120 uh, it's roughly so let's say that is where we have uh, angle 120 so with that we can now use a ruler and uh, draw our draw our our angle our our line which is 2.5 uh, so this is where we come and draw our line up to there uh, again we take a protractor and we measure an angle of 120 so this is where we have an angle of 120 Uh, so we can say that's where we have an angle on 20. Uh, again, we draw another line there. <laughs> we can make this one smaller. Uh, so we take that point and we draw our line here. All right, so that's where we draw our line. And again, we draw a line of 2.5 about there. Uh, we take our compass again 
and we say that's where we have our point and we measure an angle of one, 120 so that's where we have our point from there we take a ruler again we measure a line of uh, 2.5 uh, so that's where we have our line that's about 2.5 uh, so we take uh, our camp protractor again we measure an angle of 120 uh, we make another line here <coughs> take our ruler again we draw a line of 2.5 Uh, we draw we take our protractor again and we also we draw a line of this is the last one so actually we can just join uh, the the line there and we will be able to get our hexagon so that's uh, that's our hexagon So that is our one, two, three, four, five, six. So that's our hexagon. Uh, so with that, <laughs> we can be able now to we can use a we can use a, a protractor. Uh, we can use a compass to draw uh, to draw the 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 slanting line. That is the slanting faces. Uh, so we use our protractor here, our compass here and we measure four centimeter uh, uh, we, we, we measure using the other side so let's take it here then uh, we measure four centimeter. Those are four centimeter. So, using our compass, we can now since this is an isosceles, uh, it will be an isosceles triangle. We can now make our arc. Let's use a. We can now make uh, our our arc. and we take our track track our compass to the other side and uh, we make an arc so with that then uh, we use a ruler and uh, we draw we join the the three points to come up with the face uh, so we use uh, this one From there we draw a line and uh, again we take it to the other side and we draw another line. Let's set it properly. Not like that. So like that. So that is uh, the phase that we need. Uh, so we will continue like that and we should end up with uh, a figure that looks like this. So this is a figure that you end up with. Uh, it may not, it may have, may have uh, some shortfalls because of uh, manipulating with the, our 
my, my computer uh, drawing instruments. So this is four centimeter, and uh, this is not that. Not that is uh, that is not four point. That is uh, this is uh, what we we said is two point five, and this is four centimeter. So that's the net of uh, the solid or the the pyramid that is given. Uh, anyway, this is a guideline on how you go about it uh, using the drawing it using the instruments your geometrical instrument uh, you should get uh, a good uh, a good net so that's how you do it